Well, welcome back, everyone. So this weekend, you can grab yourself a great read while supporting a local organization. Yeah, this is always a big deal. Every year they have it. Uh, Greenville Literacy Association is holding their really good, really big, really cheap book <laughs> sale. And here to tell us more about it is Eleanor Vaughn. Thanks for being here, Eleanor. Thank you for having me. And you got the name, name right. <laughs> what a great name. Yes, I know. It's, it's hard to keep track of, but... You know, because there's so many, much to it. But it definitely tell me, took me a while. <laughs> what makes this a really good book sale? Well, first of all, we have more books than anyone else in the Southeast, so it's the largest used book sale in the Southeast, and we've got over 150,000 books this year. Yeah, incredible. Um, so wow. we have the numbers of books, but also the prices are unbeatable. Okay, so give us an example of like, yeah. let's say a book that's $20. How much could you get that book for? Well, no book is going to be more than $5, oh, so wow. they range from okay. two for a dollar to five dollars, so you can really rack up and not put a dent in your wallet. How do you organize this thing with that many books? <laughs> uh, we have a wonderful team of volunteers that works year-round uh, kind of behind the scenes to make sure that all of the donations that come in year-round are organized, cleaned, mm -hmm. priced, and packed up and ready to go for the sale. And then we've got a, a much larger team of volunteers that, that comes in this week and uh, puts the sale together for us. And I would imagine with 150,000 books that you have a wide variety of genres as well. We have everything you could ever want. So we've got everything from children's books. We have a huge children's book section this year. We have nonfiction, fiction, we've got arts, we've got home, coffee table books. We even have a section for collectibles and antiques. I would imagine if somebody had a favorite book they were looking for, you know, and really wanted mm -hmm. to own, yeah. do they have to get there, like, right away? How fast do these books fly off the shelf, so to speak? Well, it depends on how voracious you are. So you can come in uh, on Friday evening. We have our preview party. So this is a ticketed event, and it's the first access to the book. So you can get in there and get um, the first crack at the books if you are especially hungry for a title or two this year. Uh, and then Saturday morning, you can pay $10 to come in early. Uh, mm -hmm. The rest of the weekend from 8.30 to 4 on Saturday and 1 to 4 on Sunday is open to the public and free. How do you keep track of, like, that many books? For example, um, you know, when you go to a library, they have everything. You know, they know exactly where you get the books. Yeah. Right. <laughs> you know, how do you keep track? How do you know, like, if somebody asks for a certain book, where you find it with 150,000 books? <laughs> well, I don't know, but our wonderful <laughs> volunteers know, uh, the, know the sale back and forward. So okay. they um, organize all of the books year-round. They're packed into boxes by genre, and then they're placed on the tables for the sale by genre. So in general, general, you can kind of figure out what genre your book is in and then head, head that direction. Oh, man. <laughs> this has to be one of the biggest fundraisers that y'all have. Um, where, where does the money go specifically to help people in the community? It goes directly back to our mission in providing quality education to adults in the upstate. Oh, very good. And how much money did you raise uh, the last time? We raised $120,000 uh, last year and just round about that the mm -hmm. year before. And what are you going for this year? A way million? More. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, way more. Yeah, way more. Well, the 18th year you've done that, you were saying as y'all ramp up to the 20th year, it's going to really, really be a really big book sale. That's right, yeah. So this is our, actually our biggest year yet. We had a great year for donations. Mm -hmm. We have wonderful volunteers that are running that program. And we um, have seen more books coming in than ever. So we are very excited to mm -hmm. let Carolina have a crack at it. Well, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Yeah. I hope to see y'all at the book sale this weekend. I know. I want to come. I want to come. It's a really big. good, really big, really cheap, cheap book books. sale. That's right. <laughs> and it's happening where? McAllister Square in Greenville. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much. Thanks. Thanks, Eleanor. <laughs> we'll be back with more Carolina Morning right after this.